Okie doke. So, in honor of all of the hopefully good uh, DC movies coming out this year with Wonder Woman and Justice League, I figured I'm going to start my own kind of Justice League marathon. And by Justice League marathon, I mean I will play Injustice 1 and 2. Uh, let's skip this. Um, I'm recording this before Injustice 2 is out. I'm very excited for Injustice 2. It looks... Uh, well, it looks really good, I'd have to say. And Injustice 1 is a game that I really liked when it came out. Uh, but I actually haven't played the story of it since it came out. So this should be a uh, fun kind of going back and taking a look through it. So I guess let's uh, get this started. I want to say the theme of this game is really amazing. That part, God, I, I, this song is so good. Not very often can you get me to stick on a, uh, like a menu menu screen for a little bit, but this song is just, it's so good. All right, anyway, let's get it started. Uh, I don't think I have a game to continue, so we'll just do new game. Yep. Like I said, I haven't played this since like 2013. I think this came out. So this was what I really liked about this game, was that it didn't just do, yeah, here's a fucking DC fighting game, you know, enjoy. They actually, like, did a story mode, and it was, like, really good, too. Maybe I'm misremembering, maybe it won't be as good as I remember, but I remember it being pretty entertaining. So for as good as this game is and as much as I like it, I will say it's got some really quite horrible uh, character models. And it's not just like these guys here, it like, it goes into like the main hero characters. Uh, there's some good designs in this game and there's a really great character roster, but some of the characters just look really ugly. The nuke. Where'd you get it? What? You want one? Copy that. <laughs> get away from him! I'm handling this. Drugged me! Made me! Lois, my son. First Krypton, now Metropolis. People you love tend to blow up, don't they? Huh? Superman, don't! Uh. That's why I like you, Superman. You're much more gullible than. I love the concept of this. Joker just got bored of messing with Batman, so he just starts really hardcore fucking with Superman. Yeah. You think you can have a family? That locking me up will magically reform me. And they'll be safe. So big, so dumb. <laughs> now run along, so I can break out of here. I've got lots of planning to do to top this. That's enough. I know it's soon, but think you'll ever love a 
again. Maybe you won't kill your next family. Uh, you'll notice that the two actors that played Superman and Batman, obviously Kevin Conroy, and returning from Justice League, which I was very happy about, was uh, George Newbern as Superman. They also got, um, oh, what's her name, Susan Eisenberg to be uh, Wonder Woman, which is great. Got a lot of returning cast members here. I mean, like, what a- this is such a good character roster for, like, a DC fan like myself. Like, we've got Hal Jordan, my- one of my favorite heroes of all time, Sinestro, probably my favorite supervillain, Shazam and Black Adam, I mean, that's just great stuff. Not too sure about why my Hawk Girl is in this, though. Wonder Woman? Aquaman? Let's wrap this up. I've got to get to the watchtower. Before Luthor throws something else at us. <laughs> Should have been a combined assault. Clark sometimes forgets he can't do everything himself. Hey, Nightwing, my favorite character. Now... I've never read the comics based on this because I just I don't really see the point of um, like reading a comic book based on a video game that was based on a comic book. So I'd rather just like read the comics that these characters were based from. Uh, but apparently in the Injustice comic, this I'll never I will never ever get out of it. Like I will never ever get um, over this. In the comics, Nightwing dies by falling down and breaking his head on a rock. I like I'll never get over that ever. Just like you said. He hasn't moved in hours. What in the hell? What is that? How'd Joker do this? He didn't. The real trap is behind us. You're so clever. <laughs> You're Luther's pet now, Deathstroke? His money's green, and as a bonus, I get to kill Batman. Sorry, that wasn't intentional. As soon as the gameplay started, I got a phone call. Ah, oh, man, I haven't played this in forever. I played it with Chris a little bit, uh, like, a little while ago, doing the, um, multiplayer, so it's gonna take a little bit to get used to how to play this again. Okay, um, but yeah, you'll notice that some of the, some of the character models kind of look a little weird. Oh, wow, there's something weird with this controller. It's all sticky. But, um, yeah, some of the characters look a little weird. I don't like most of Batman's designs in this game. Uh, this one looks fine, but, um, I really don't like the, the one that we saw in the, like, beginning, the, I think, Insurgents Batman or whatever in the continuity where Superman kills the Joker. He just looks like the Christian Bale uh, Batman, which I, you know, I don't think looks good. So, it's always a fun time there. I think I'm facing the wrong way. Th this one still looks weird, it's just his head looks really tiny. Wonder Woman looks too much like a man. Aquaman looks fine. I think even Superman looks fine, even though I think he looks more like Bruce Wayne wearing a Superman outfit. But whatever, I'll try not to complain about how ugly the characters look. 
Uh, so Batman is pretty much like the scorpion of this game. He has like, you know, the, um, the grappling hook is like, just get over here! Only instead of getting over there, you bring yourself to them. It's pretty cool. Uh, so obviously, as you could probably no doubt tell, I'm not very amazing at uh, fighting games. As I'm going to demonstrate here by trying to finish off Deathstroke by punching him in the dick a little bit. Oh, alright, well, I was really hoping to just kick him in the dick a bunch. Uh, I personally really like, um, I like, I like faster characters that maybe don't deal as much damage. Uh, like Nightwing is my, the character that I'm the best at in this game. Batman to Watchtower, come in. Nightwing. I don't know. I, I just I don't. I've never really liked Nether Realms uh, like art styles. The characters just look really like off. And I'm, I, I have to mention I'm not like too big a Mortal Kombat fan either. For that exact reason, I kind of think like all Nether Realm games, they the character designs aren't very good, which is why I can't really enjoy Mortal Kombat too much. This is fine because it's characters that are already established. Thunder of the gods, Flash. Thunder of the gods. What does that make us? The poor slobs who clean up the mess. Now I don't remember if it's um, Alan Tudyk doing the voice of, of uh, Green Arrow, I think it is. But Stephen Amell is also listed in the credits as Green Arrow. I think he might do it for like a now, different no skin or something, I don't remember. Took me almost two minutes to break your encryption. Nice work. Faye. He esperado mucho tiempo para esto. Now I break your back. Are so you got to break first? Your body or your spirit? Uh, so that that was one of my big complaints. Actually, we're seeing it right on screen right now. Is that Martian Manhunter doesn't fucking do anything in the game? Martian Manhunter is one of my absolute favorite characters of all time, and uh, until they release him in a DLC, he is not in the game. This just shouldn't work. Like, I shouldn't be able to throw things at Bane like that. Ow. Hold on, Bane. Where's Bane? I'm gonna make one more uh, comment about the character's looks, and I'm gonna say that Lex Luthor looks like Bruce Willis. Stop hitting yourself! Stop hitting yourself! That was a little absurd. Okay, these things need to stop coming in because that's really cheap that I could just keep doing that. It, it, I like how uh, Netherrealm, they actually listen to people, unlike Bioware, when um, Injustice 2 was first like being demonstrated, people realized how like really ugly it looked. Uh, at least some of the characters, like it was mainly the female characters, just looked really ugly. Uh, well, I lose this one. I don't break easily. And they fixed a lot of the characters, and it looks like really way better now. Well, I'm just gonna start punching him in his dick. This is how Batman wins fights. Like, read a goddamn comic. You'll know every single fight Batman's ever been in, he wins by just punching his opponent in the dick. How is Bane's dick hitbox not, like, just absurd? Alright, fine. I hit him in the dick, everyone saw it. Bane, Catwoman, Grundy. You're all alone, Luther. I don't see Grundy here Jesus at all. Often are. Psychopaths like you. You hero types are all alike, even less imposing close up. You're testing my patience. Oh, there's another fight already. 
Yeah, there's some sections like this that break up the just straight fighting. They're kind of cool, but they're like a little weird. Did I press the wrong button? Yeah. They're they're neat. I think this is pretty much just like he'll start the fight off with a little bit less health, and uh, if you fail this, you'll start with a little less health. So it's um. They go on a little too long. I remember there's one at the end with Superman and, and Black Adam that the first time I played, I just kind of failed on purpose because it was just taking too long. Time to teach you, humility. you don't lose enough health for it to like actually be a problem. Like, see, we both have equal health. Get over here. Wow, well... <laughs> Luther was watching my last fight with Bane and was like, well, I'm not going to let him throw those things at me. Uh, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't really like Luthor's battle suit in this. I like just the the plain one in like the comics, or it wasn't just this big armored suit like this. Get down. Oh, great! Another one. Thanks. Whoever keeps programming these, thank you. so good. I love, like, all the characters and how they feel very different. You know, like, pretty much you use the same buttons to get, like, different moves out for each character, but they have different moves and they all feel different. And I guess that's pretty much how every single fighting game works, but it's, I think, the most apparent in this one for some reason. If Batman would stop gliding, that would be amazing. I also love their special spooky moves like this. And a lot of them just don't make sense. Like this one doesn't make sense. How does the Batmobile get on the Justice League Watchtower? Try this on, genius. Your genius is showing. Superman, report. It's done. The others are mopping up. Taking Doomsday into deep space. Make sure it's very. Why was Catwoman space. doing this? This seems out of character for Catwoman. What's that? It's the none of your damn business alone. <laughs> Radiological Metropolis. <laughs> I can see the headlines. Justice League fails. Cloud kills millions. You gave him a nuke. Most of the League dies, and Superman's beloved city is vaporized. I console the masses by offering to rebuild it in my own image of... Oh. He was done. This is Batman. Code Red. Everyone to these coordinates. Now! <laughs> Baldy said remember to... <laughs> ah, there we are. Mr. J, it works! Oh! I really like the Back Joker the and Harley party. designs. That's an like I never, I've never been a fan of the new Fifty Two oh, Harley, but uh, this one is like the closest Go. to uh, me liking it. No one likes a third wheel. Batman, burr, burr. my coup de coup, my palm de frit. I knew that ape Destro couldn't kill you. Too bad for you. Why so jumpy? I merely took it off standby. It's this button you've got to worry about. There they are. Keep him talking, Bruce. Don't wait for us, Barry. Go! You push that button and eight million die. Eight million and two, darling. I was going to enjoy the fireworks from a safe distance. But now that you're here, what say we have one last dance? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.